All right guys, for this rainbow jar science experiment, you need kind of a lot of things, but we have everything here in the house. It's pretty common household items. So what you need, some olive oil, some Dawn dishwashing, or you can use the palm olive one, the green one, some light corn syrup, this is honey, you need a jar, you need rubbing alcohol, you need water, you may want food coloring, and uh, we have a dropper here as well. So the idea behind this is to teach your kids about density and how different liquids weigh more than each other and how they separate into different colors of the rainbow whenever you go to put it in the jar. So let's see how this works. All right, so the first liquid we're gonna do is the honey. All right, now we're gonna take our Cairo syrup, and I'm gonna pour some into a cup here. We need some food coloring on this one. What color should we use? Green. Now we're gonna do our green Cairo syrup. We wanna do this one just like the honey, right in the middle. Don't let any of it touch the sides. Why is the Cairo syrup not mixing with the honey? Do you think the honey has more or less molecules? Less molecules. Which one? This one. The green one or the brown one? The green one. The green one, you're right. That's why it's staying on top. Now we have to do our dishwashing liquid. Why is it not mixing with the Cairo syrup and the honey? Why do you think? Cause I don't know. Hmm, does it, how many molecules do you think it has in it? One, two, three, four, five. Is that less than the Cairo syrup? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and that's why it's not mixing. It has less molecules. Now we need to do some water. But since we used blue dish soap, we need to color this water a different color. Red. You wanna do red? I'm gonna let brother start the red this time, okay? Green. Good job. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Good job. That's enough. Did you wanna pour the water in? I want you to be very careful. Whoa. Take your olive oil now, and we're gonna pour that one on in. Put a pretty thick layer. Okay, that's good. Now, the least dense is this one. This is called alcohol, so we have to be very careful with it. I'm gonna this. do the alcohol. I think Daddy's gonna do the alcohol. I'm gonna watch. <laughs> okay. All right, guys, last color of the rainbow is that we're gonna do in here is purple. So we're gonna mix our red and our blue with our last one. Look at that, is that blue and red mixed together? Yeah, I want to dump it. What color do you think that's gonna turn whenever I swirl it? Purple. You think so? Uh -huh. Let's find out. Look up at the light, that's purple, you see it? You see the purple? That looks pretty, huh? For the alcohol, you're gonna wanna use your dropper because you don't want it to mix with the oil. There's a, uh, it doesn't separate as well whenever uh, you're doing it. And that's why we suggest putting a thicker layer of oil. So now I'm taking my dropper and I'm just dropping it on the sides like this. Uh, just kind of going around so that it doesn't actually penetrate the oil. Alrighty guys, we have our jar, our rainbow jar. Hopefully it worked. Okay, we got a light. Everybody's holding their part. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> we got a chair, clipped it to the chair. We're gonna take our jar, watch out buddy. Jar coming in, jar coming in. Ooh. You can see all the colors. Is that neat? Y'all like y'all's rainbow jar? Hey, y'all did a great job on those. Can I get a high five? Can you get a high five? Good job, science for the win.